We're at what's going on YouTube. Uh, today we got some 22 Creedmoor stuff going on. Um, I'm in between trying to get to the range, so I've got uh, doing some load stuff. Um, but uh, I think you got most of you guys have seen this already. I got uh, 22 Creedmoor from Horizon Firearms here, 18 inch barrel threaded. Um, really, really, really nice rifle. Um, takes map mag pull mags. Uh, Three-way mags. There's some hand-loaded, um, not hand-loaded, but uh, factory ammo right there. Um, stuff's accurate. Night force scope on top. Um, this is just a, a banging gun, and it's, it's light. Shoots really well. Um, Hornady just sent uh, factory ammo now. It's going to be selling um, from Horizon Firearms on their on their 22 Creedmoor website. So if you guys need factory ammo, go check them out. At, um 20, 22 com. um but that being said um i'm gonna start doing some hand loading for this some of the powders i'm gonna be using will be the winchester um stay ball match and the stay ball hd i'm gonna try those out um i got some hornady brass for 20, 20 cream more and i got some peterson brass for 22 cream more um the peterson brass will be once fired from factory ammo um i've got some 75 grain ELD matches. I've got some 88 grain ELD matches and some 90 grains um, A tips that I'm gonna be running and uh, 300 of each. And I've got a bunch of other brands, but that's what I'm gonna be starting with. Um, I'm super excited for that. Um, this is gonna be fun. Oh, this is an awesome cartridge. Um, you know, if you're pushing the cartridge really hard, you know, you might get about 2,000 rounds through it. But if you know, if you if you go a little heavier bullet, which is designed for is a one and eight twist, but it's it's designed to shoot some of the heavier bullets, and so it's just just it's if you can use a twenty two cal or two two four right um, diameter bullet in the state to hunt your like deer, um, you can do it. Uh, it's more than capable. Um, mainly for me, it's going to be a coyote gun because here in Washington we have to be two forty three or bigger um, for uh, medium to big game. So this is basically going to be a uh a coyote gun for me um i do want to take it down to texas and go shoot some pigs with it that'll be awesome i may take it on pronghorn hunt that'd also be awesome i know derek with horizon um shot an outad with it or odd or however you say it with this rifle uh, rifle and i believe it was with factory ammo these guys right here and so that to me is really cool um there's there is let's see here um, I'll grab, I'll grab the factory ammo that I got, some of the stuff that I got here, and uh, I'll show you guys. Sorry if the camera works a little shaky. Um, let me grab it real quick. Okay, so here's Texas ammo. This is the stuff that they load up right here. Um, you can get this at 22creamore.com. But he shot, I believe, with the 80 grain ELDMs and Outad at 350 yards i believe don't quote me i could be wrong on that um but uh yeah it's the stuff's accurate um it's not cheap but no factory ammo is cheap right and then this is going to be approved to be semi uh semi uh semi cartridge soon here so um you're going to be seeing it probably a lot more like you see pearson brass right there 22 creed more it's gonna be awesome i'm looking forward to doing it I'm, I'm going to be running my hybrid 46M can on the end here. Um, that'll be, so I shoot it suppressed. It's going to be really fun to shoot. The gun already has no recoil. Throwing that can on the end is going to make it really have no recoil. Really, this this cartridge is a really neat cartridge. I'm not a big Creedmoor fan. I am a big 22 Creedmoor fan. Um, to me, this is, it's just awesome. And, you know, with the 22 Arc, it's going to compete with that a little bit. Um, but this is going to shoot the heavier bullets, I believe, better. But we'll we'll see. Going down the road, there's lots going to be lots of powder options we're going to be trying. Um, I am going to be writing an article on this rifle. Um, it will be, I believe, in the Spring Varmint Magazine for next year. So um, that will be cool. But uh, real quick, I just want to talk about kind of what I'm going to be getting into for the 22 Creedmoor, along with the 30-06 that's going on. Um, so I'm trying to work those in similar. And I also have the 25-06 I'm also working. So lots of irons in the fire and mess but uh bench is getting a little cleaner so um yeah that's gonna do it um if you guys got any questions let me know um 
but stay tuned we are going to be getting out and shooting this this is it's just a it's just a beautiful gun and it shoots so well it's off of a remington 700 uh footprint it's just a nice action the barrel is just awesome on this thing nice fluted super nice night four scope on it it's just her right i mean it says it right there horizon firearms this is just a nice rifle it's awesome pleasure to shoot really nice composite stock it's just it's awesome to shoot so all right guys um that's gonna do it for the video um make sure you like subscribe and share stay tuned for a bunch of 22 cream more coming up all right guys